looking back at that Montreal game, you guys were up late as well and let the opposing team back in. Kind of a similar scenario, a little bit with a little more time left in the game this time around. But how, how frustrating is it to continue losing games in, in this kind of fashion? Yeah, it's, uh, it's definitely frustrating. I mean, we got to learn how to close out a game. I think it's, it's obviously huge. Know. So, yeah, I mean, I thought we played a pretty solid game. And then, you know, we could just give it away at the end. So, um, yeah, it's tough. What did you see on that uh, goal that was scored right before the end of regulation to send it to overtime? Yeah, uh, I haven't watched it yet, but um, I think I might have let my guy go through. So um, that's on me. And I mean, like I said, I have to watch it, so I'm not 100% sure. But, um, yeah, I can't, can't give up a goal there. So. How much of you guys saying the game was on Felix Sanchez tonight? Yeah, he was awesome for sure. I mean, they got some uh, really good players over there, and uh, they got some great A chances. And I think he hung in there well and, and gave us a chance to win. So props to him. You scored on, uh, I guess, a nice bounce off of uh, the goaltender. How much of an emphasis was their place just on trying to get the puck on the net tonight for you guys? Yeah, I think uh, it's pretty big. And um, I mean, for me personally, I think I sometimes uh, tentative to shoot. Uh, so. Just trying to get pucks to the net and uh, got a fortunate bounce there. What do you think didn't work on that last power play, the last kind of wrapping power plays in the third period there when you guys had the goal, the goal lead and a chance to kind of go on? Uh, I think we did a, an RA job of getting set up. I think just didn't get enough pucks to the net and uh, second chances. I think you get the one chance and then you want to recover the puck and get another one or get a chance off a rebound or something. And I think that kind of breaks down the penalty kill and we didn't uh, we didn't do a great job of that. How challenging is, is this mentally, not just physically, but mentally just kind of going through this whole stretch here? Yeah, it's, it's tough. I mean, to be honest, I think there's still a, a good feeling in the in the locker room. I mean, you know, we're, we're working hard. We're obviously, you know, you can make as many excuses as you want, but, uh, you know, it's, it's obviously tough when you're missing so many guys. And, um, you know, I think everyone's working their hardest. It's just, uh, you know, we got to finish games and, uh, you know, focus in on some of the little details that are kind of costing us. The team went on a number of losing streaks last season. What can you pull on from those experiences to help you kind of deal with and navigate this one right now? Yeah, I mean, just the fact that we've kind of been on them before, I think uh, it's not not something that you really want to have experience with. But, um, you know, I think just trying to stay positive in the locker room and, uh, you know, not turning on each other or, or blaming anyone. I think, um, you know, just like I said, stay together and, uh, you know, it'll come as long as we keep working hard.